Hey, what's going on, guys? I'm Joseph. Welcome back. And in today's video from One Fruit Simulator, I'm going to be comparing all of the fruits like light, mera, and sand. I'm going to be comparing the damages, and we're gonna be also checking out the DPS to decide which fruit is the best one. I'm going to be showing the AOEs, the damages, and everything. I have max stats in almost everything other than defense, but defense is not dealing any damage. We have armament hockey. Look, 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 look. Armament is really, really good addition, guys. You should definitely go get it, okay? Go get it. You just need 100,000 be berries, not bellies, berries. And you guys should definitely subscribe, hit the like, turn on post notification, join my Discord server, join my Roblox group, and subscribe to my second channel. All of the links are down in the description. You guys can also check it out my merch. You guys can see it on the screen. And I also doing shout outs and let's start. Okay, I have light, so let's start with light. We have light sword, as you guys saw, normal hit 432. You see this? This is with hockey. Without hockey, look. Look at the difference. 144. So yeah, get the hockey, guys. And mastery full, fruitful, everything full. Let's just start. Light kick. It was 8780. The cooldown is four seconds. One more time. You guys see four seconds, right? Next one is light boom. 17,550. And the cooldown is 11 seconds. Next we have light. I'm also going to be comparing the flying speeds. I just have to find some place where I can test it. We are going to do that in this video as well. Okay, divine light. 10,333 and the cooldown is 31 seconds. Okay, and the boss is back. He has 75,000 HP. So let's see if I can one shot him. I'm not gonna be entering to not trigger auto clicker like Game Pass. So let's try it. Yep, I'm dealing more than 75,000 HP. It's 84,240 damage. So with max stats, we can basically one shot everything currently in the game other than the beast the sea beast sea beast has like 700,000 hp and uh -huh. that's that's a fight man okay and the cooldown from light javels is 47 seconds so overall the dps is 5915 damage per second is when we are using every skill so like spamming like this one you know you're spamming 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 and you're dealing like 5915 per second with all of the cooldowns if you're spamming spamming over and over again okay now i'm going to show you guys the aoe so we are going to the pirates island and we are on pirates island and let's see okay here we have like cool spot with three of them so if we are going to be aiming in the middle we can fight we can defeat all of them at the same time okay same with light boom you guys see okay and by the way with light kick we can be like way farther let's see you see seems nice right divine light let's see we can aim with it so okay i clicked the wrong button uh <laughs> divine light two of them did this dude get hit no not really it's kind of weird how the divine lights is looking but yeah uh let's see over here if we can hit them with light kick we can with boom probably uh as well hmm can we do something like like aiming over here and hit all of those four npcs mm, almost almost one more try maybe over here hmm it's like a few centimeters and we can do it, right? Oh. Hmm. I did it! Okay, so we can. It's it's nice to know, right? Uh how about the light boom? Uh not really. It's it's way sm smaller. Okay. Um Divine Lights. I don't know why, but this skill is for me, in my opinion, is a little bit buggy or it's not made how it's supposed to be like you can see it's flying around but 
deals damage only from close up um i'm gonna show you that i'm going to show you guys that in 40 seconds okay let's look can i deal them no but when i'm going closer a little bit closer i can deal it so let's say we're gonna be standing here we can hit both of them with light jewels so yeah okay that was the light fruit uh we're just gonna test the last thing that is going to be the fly speed we are going to be testing it on the first island and maybe hmm, how we can do it oh maybe from it's hard to choose some maybe from this tree to that tree over there okay three two one wait i'm just gonna transform myself into the light and let's go boom I don't know how, how much seconds is that but we are gonna be testing it so our route is this tree to this tree always we are gonna be testing the fly speed okay next fruit um we are going for mera equip it fruit and let's already test the fly speed right why not it's also maxed out and okay this you're aiming over there right transform into the flight three two one let's go boom it's way slower okay okay let's go back to the syrup island fire flies deals 10,530 the the cooldown is four seconds next we have fire fist fire fist deals 17,550 and the cooldown is nine seconds then we have flight right cooldown two seconds doesn't matter for the damage then we have fire pillar and this one deals 26320 and the cooldown is 17 seconds and the last one is the fire emperor that deals 42,120 and the cooldown is 19 seconds so do you guys think that the mera is stronger than the light i can tell you guys already that the mera deals 8,346 damage per second and the light deals only 5,950 so there's a big increase in damage uh, mera versus light right so Let's just test the AoE and decide which one is better from those two and then we have sand. So fireflies, let's see the AoE. I'm going to be aiming over here. No AoE at all. Let's check the distance. Can we aim at those dudes over there? We should be able to hit them. But did we? No, we did not. And that's kind of sad. <laughs> okay, maybe too buggy. Yep. We could hit the buggy that's good okay fire fire fist let's see mm, no damage at all so no aoe we are gonna test if we at least can hit both of them over here so like only one dude okay that's that's really bad i'm not gonna lie that's really bad wait maybe in the middle nope not at all okay uh fire pillar should be able to hit three of them yes it did uh it does hit three of them but maybe we can hit four of them that stand in the similar position like with the light so like mm, nah only three of them not bad to be honest not bad and it deals like twenty six thousand damage it's okay okay fire emperor let's see i remember it was buggy so <laughs> that's really nice and the cooldown is not the lock 42,000 damage and 19 seconds of cooldown okay let's test it one more time maybe from this position maybe over here if we can hit five of them that's gonna be crazy okay oh my god okay i love the fire emperor right now it's 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 really cool <laughs> okay 
Okay, that's nice. Wait, 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 wait. Okay. One. Okay. One more time. Over here. Wait. Eh, depends when you're gonna be aiming, but it can do some damage. Okay. And that was fire. We tested every single thing. Now let's move to the Suna. Okay, let's test the fly speed already so over here three two one let's go oh this is really 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 slow um i think i'm gonna just use the boat and uh, okay i'm just gonna fly there okay are you guys ready to test the sooner and uh, maybe let's stand here okay first one sun spikes Deals 12,290. Four seconds cooldown. Okay, send tornado. This one deals 48,270. And the cooldown is 11 seconds. Sun flight, of course. And sand storm. This one, this one deals 19,300. Cooldown is 30 seconds. Okay, let's test the sand emperor. Last skill. This one deals 31,590 and the cooldown is 44 seconds. And do you guys think that the Santa is better than the other two fruits? And with the DPS, it is. DPS of the Santa is 8,820. Mera is 8,346. And the light is 5,915. So the Santa is the best damage dealing fruit. Let's test the... It's the slowest flying, but the highest dealing. Let's test the AoE and we are gonna decide which fruit is the best. Okay, let's test the Sand Spikes. I can already tell you guys that this one is crazy. The distance, uh, it's really like, good. Wait, can we maybe do something like this? Look. close one close one to this probably we we can do it but I, I don't know if i'm gonna be testing it we can hit up to three maybe even four in the straight line with the sun spikes and the damage is really really decent like twelve thousand, and also the cooldown is low okay send tornado let's see in the middle not a lot of aoe but it's 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 moving forward right the cooldown is 11 seconds, but the damage is 48,000. So, um, dealing it like this should be good for, I think, uh, two NPCs at once. Maybe, maybe something like this would be even be better. Like, look, over here. Two. And... Okay, <laughs> only two. But damage is really good. Okay, um, Sand Storm should be able to hit three of them. The area seems really big. Wait, can we hit four? Oh my god, the cooldown is really big. Okay, uh, let's test the Sand Emperor in the meantime. So let's stand maybe in the middle over here and let's see. Mm -hmm. Seems big, right? But it's like only in the in the in the middle. Okay, um, Sunstorm, come on, come on, come on, come on, over here, and, okay, 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 seems like one of the biggest AoEs, uh, right after, I think, the Fire Emperor from the Merua, that has less cooldown, more damage than the Sunstorm, I would be, like, a little bit, uh, I don't know which fruit I would choose, Sunstorm one more time, over here, maybe over here, are we in the middle? Uh, probably we can a little bit stand closer and hit more of them. Depends. Okay, one more time the Sand Emperor, but in the like in this in this in the first person is the best to be honest to aim. Okay, let's see. Four of them. Not bad, right, guys? You just have to, like, stand in a, in a good position. I believe that's everything in this video. If you guys want to 
no something else or i don't know let me know in the comments what you guys want to see from me and i will see in the next one thank you so much for watching bye bye